Good morning to you. A very frosty, cold morning. Thank you, Mrs. H. A very sort of autumnal winter display there. The old um right, time for a shave though. It's never too cold for a shave with a nice hot water. Uh, another sort of a mix and match stuff really. Um soap of choice. Anyway, again too excited. How are you doing? Welcome to the welcome to the shave den, to the bathroom. Hope um you're doing okay since I've seen you last. Excuse the hair, it's I was starting to comb it sideways because it's getting so long. Uh, well for me anyway. Edwin Jagger, traditional shaving soap, limes and pomegranate for sensitive and normal skin. And that's that formulation. And I've just you can see it, it's a tiny little puck. I have bloomed it. So I'm gonna use that as a pre-shave. It's a lovely sort of a zing to the scent. That's the box it comes in. Um, I used it before. And this is the king of this uh, shave, isn't it? This is the Gillette Fat Boy F4. And uh, obviously adjustable. Twist to open. This is a, a classic standard condition. Really nice, these. Um, twist to open. Inside, I'm going to put this Persona Platinum. And this is its uh, fifth, ooh, fifth use. Fifth use for the Persona Red. It is overhang, quarter turn to lock it. You can see there, number nine, most aggressive for this razor. And we'll, and we'll head down the aggression. Um, I've just realized I've shown you on camera on here. Never mind, we'll use this camera. Well, you can see this quite clear on, on, on there, can you? That's good, yeah. Lovely razor. Um, brush is the AP Shave Company. Uh, this is the red. And the synthetic knot, uh, I'll put, for the size of it now, 20 something, I'll put on the screen here. Really, really soft knot, this. Um, nice brush. Um, so, yeah, I'll just put the pre-shave on now. Well, the bloom water. I'll just rinse the face first. And then we'll uh, go to the other camera to create the lather. Right, here we go. Oh, that's nice and hot. I was going to use a, a scuttle again, hot water, because it felt so good in this. But if you don't use it in the winter, the frosty days, uh, when are you going to use it? So, um, yeah, we'll head down. I'm not going to use a, um, a scuttle or anything like that. I'll use the pot it's in. So we'll head down, create the lather, back for the shave. No, we're not. Get it right in a minute. Bloom water, Paul. Otherwise, I'd... Have to not film that. Note to anybody: don't bother filming your shaves. You start to do silly things like forget bits. That's just the water. Good stuff. No parabens. Lovely scent, not a powerful scent, I'd say a three out of ten in strength at the moment. But uh, lovely British made, that can go. Right, right see you for the uh, lather up.
So there we go. Not going to create the lather on that because it's obviously too small. Just gather off onto the brush and then there's enough for the shave. We can always go back to it. I'm going to re-wet that. That's had a nice time to soak in. Here we go. Mm, right, a bit of water. Mm. I really enjoy mix and match, what I class, or what I call mix and match shaves. Using different things, nothing related, uh, not even the scents sometimes, it's uh, just different. Makes it, uh, makes the shave unique, doesn't it? That'll do, nice and tidy. So, we'll start off with, as I say, We'll heat the fat boy up. We're using the Gillette Fat Boy F4. And um, setting nine, most aggressive, Persona Red, fifth use. First pass on this midweek shave. Welcome aboard. Definitely getting the lime scent, the citrusy scent. Um, there is a difference to it, so that must be pomegranate, because I've never thought of, I've eaten pomegranates many times, but I've never, never thought what it smelled like, funny. Never, well, there's nothing, you, you don't get a pomegranate and smell it, do you? Well, I don't, but... Uh, Blade uh, feels nice. Wow. So you can feel the blade there. It's uh, it's the most aggressive setting on this razor. Um, I'd say for me personally, as in a, an aggression based on all razors I've used, uh, I wouldn't say it's aggressive. But you can feel the blade there. I'd say it's like, if there's such a thing, it's a low end aggression, uh, but very nice. Yeah. Right, okay, let's go. Are you having a shave? Are you having, are you planning one? Are you, you've had one? Let me know, it's not. Oh, look. I didn't notice. Not a pimple, is it? Got some whiskers coming out of there. I can't there then. Oh, it might be a little pimple there. Damn it. Because hmm. I th thought I'd never cut. Mind you, sometimes when you're giving it the old jibber jabber, you don't feel the old neck, you know. There's only one neck we want this time of year, and that's Saint Nick. <laughs> oh, I'm too good for this place. Right, second application. Beautiful brush. Yeah, I think that was a. I think that was a little. Uh, a little old pimpel, I think. Mm. He's showing through the red dot. Right, 
razor is nice and clean. We'll <coughs> just open it up slightly. And we'll take it down without glasses. Oh, very brave. We've got number six, which is a dot in this case. But it is overhang to be well. But it's no problem. God, I need a heck of a tidy up. Well, that's a nice setting, you see. So how's the week been for you? All right. That is a nice aggression. I like that. Uh, what I class as a right well just slightly above a mid aggression just above a standard lovely nice and smooth but yet it's still got that little sort of bite to it that keenness of cutting these these words i say sometimes is my own language i say And the dog over there agrees. Beautiful, beautiful razor. Start of the half, start of the week, come on, start of the half week, midweek. Have not to go back to the um, puck. Again, another very, very soft brush, soft bristle brush on the edges, on the tips. Synthetic, obviously, but um, works really nicely. Nice backbone to it for it. That's a hard puck, but it's giving it out on each pass as I want it. Really nice. Um, <clears throat> should we chance going down again? Well, yeah, we'll use it as an adjustable. So we'll go down to six, five. Uh, let's go to three. What should I use? Three of those. You know, against the growth, we'll keep it on three for against the growth and for pickup time, shall we? Soap is very slick, very nice soap, easy to lather as you can see for a hard puck. And you can lather up as long as you want. Um, If you got the time. Mm. No nearer than blood. Little fly. Yeah, good slickness this. This soap is too slick to go any lower than three for me. On this razor. Uh, 
Alles Eis. What a play, the old persona. The fifth youth. Good. I've had a lot of high numbered shaves with the with the persona. And especially the British made them um, uh, Wilkinson Swords. Wow. That's lovely. That is nice. Well, you know what time it is now. So I'll see you. <laughs> Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. Yeah. Come on. Let's get there. I don't think there's a lot there to take, but it'll certainly be satisfactory and comforting to try. That's the sound you want to, you want to hear. But when you think you've had it all, you look like another one here. You listen to this. Not judged then. Perfect. Now for a cold water rinse in a cold day. Well, out, God, that is cold. Out there. Whew, holy smoke. God, that's like ice. I suppose, yeah, have the pipes, you see, from the frostiness and. Oh, oh. Very refreshing. Oh. Homemade, can you guess? Tea tree and witch hazel. That's nice. That last bit in that bottle is a, seems to last and last. And, That aftershave, don't use this one often. Mersel um, aftershave, this is the mentholated green. Um, God, this will feel cold in this. Uh, oh, it's like polo mints. That's nice. Extra strong mint, polar mint type here. Wow, that's nice. That is nice. A bit of there is a bit of menthol in that. 
Yeah. Yeah, you can feel it on the skin. Are you slightly sort of thinking, hang on, what's going on here? And then just some Marco, this is the sensitive, is it? After yeah, the sensitive aftershave balm. Arco. Good stuff, Arco. There's a good winter. There's a good winter moisturizer. See if you've got icy weather or cold cold winds. All right, did I tell you you don't need a lot? This is a good reflector barrier. Oh, that's nice. There you go. There we go, that's what it's all about. Mix and match, work the treat. Nothing sort of, sometimes nice to have a matching shave, isn't it, with different scents which go with each other but sometimes just go off the cuff and mentholated aftershave pomegranate and lime soap <laughs> you know it's, it's just lovely right i'm keeping it up so we've used the uh, gillette fat boy as a standard condition for its age not been done up or anything um this is a part of a collection sent to me, as many of you know, by Donald Roberts. Don, there we go. Thank you, sir. Hope you're well, if you're watching. Um, we've used it on setting nine, first pass, most aggressive. It's a nice aggression. It's a, you can feel it there. We've used setting six for across the growth. Setting three against the growth and for pickup time. Persona Red, the, um, that was used, that was its fifth use. Really nice. Um, we've had two little necks, well, maybe three, if that's a tiny, isn't it a tiny one? One there, didn't feel that, and that was like a pimple type thing, so that was a, a genuine neck there, but that was it. Uh, and didn't even feel it there, but uh, no issues, otherwise. We've used, uh, what else we used? Cold Welsh water, like ice, that is. And we've used the homemade tea tree and witch hazel. And um, the Mersol, the Mersol um, aftershave formula K, green, mentholated and minty sort of scent to it, like a polo or extra strong mint, really nice. And okay, the uh, AP Shave Company brush, so that lovely brush this, nice, good handle and uh, really soft. But a good backbone does its job. Um, Edwin Jagger, obviously the main soap. I'm doing it backwards. Eh? The uh, pome limes and pomegranates. Really, really nice. Uh, sort of sense, scent strength about 3 out of 10. Um, lime, citrusy, with something else in it. And that something else must be the pomegranate. And it goes well. It's a really nice, fresh, refreshing scent. Um, and really slick, nice, and then the Arco sensitive, and that's it, leave you in peace, if you're having a shave, have a good one, enjoy yourself, get out of it, um, stay safe, stay happy, and well, and I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave, don't know what I'm doing, uh, shave wise, but uh, I'm sure I'll make something, oh, it feels lovely that, I'll make something up before we get there, and uh, ready, so have a great week, thank you for joining me, thanks for your company, look after yourselves, and bye bye. Thank you.